is the game not capturing? Hold on. Uh, hi. Why is the... Hello? It's... Okay, it's picking up the audio. Hi, Essie. Hi, JD. And anyone else who's lurking, hello. Uh, pfft. Hold on. Let me try window capture. Where is it? No, it's not there. That's odd. Yeah, let's, this might be risky, but any full screen application. That's a full screen application. Come on, you can do this. Uh, hmm. Because I don't, I really, really do not like, um, I really do not like, uh, display capture. I really don't want to do display capture. <laughs> Hold on, uh, I'll figure this out, I'll figure this out, I'll figure this out. Okay, come on. Spirit Fairer. I'm gonna turn off notifications. There we go. Okay, come on. Hmm. Let me, let me, let me restart the game. Maybe, maybe that'll do it. Okay. Stream's off to a great start, huh? <laughs> Well, I'm trying to fix this. How are we all doing? How, how's everyone doing? I hope the day is treating you all well. It's a lovely, lovely Saturday. Uh, I am doing... Oh, there we go. There we go. I don't know. Hmm. It's working now. Anyways, hi. Hope, uh, hope the weekend is treating you all well. I'm doing swell. Uh, I might have just finished the model. The, uh, my, my 3.0. It, it's done, I think. I need to do, like, one last test of it. But it, it, it's done. <laughs> it's, it, it'll be, it'll be done. Oh my god. <laughs> ah, I'm so excited. The only thing that really sucks, though, is that I have so many toggles. Without a stream deck, I'm kind of screwed. <laughs> Which really, really sucks, but hey ho, let's. Oh, oh, this game is co op. Anyways, let's, uh, Spirit Farah, let's go. I I got this game because, uh, so Mar Mari, Mari Gato, my lovely VTuber daughter, uh, she. Oh, that's a cute animation. She got the Humble Bundle. And, uh, she was, uh, I think this was like a game that she maybe already had so i i got this uh i i was like oh yeah i'll take the code oh this looks cool oh cat ah finally let me put the price on my phone down ah uh. um do i how do i Advance. Oh, E. I thought for a second you would never wake up, little one. How ironic that would have been, would it not? Oh, thank you for this. Stretch! Ow! Ow! <sighs> I'm Charon. Who, this person? Uh, I. Uh, Charon, I guess. Spirit Pharaoh. Well, that is what I have been until your arrival. Yeah, I think uh, I forget what Charon actually is, but I know he exists in like Greek mythology. Uh, I think he oh, is he like the he takes you down the river Styx, was it? I don't I don't remember. I'm I'm not that knowledgeable on Greek mythology, but uh, yeah, it's. I, I, I do enjoy seeing it. Well, that is what I have been until your arrival. I cannot say that I am sad to leave, but I still had a few things left to do here. I'm afraid you will have to pick up things where I left them. 
It is, after all, my very last day. Have you played Alien Isolation? Nah, I don't- I don't own the game, now. Only thing I know is that Zeus was around the block a lot of times. <laughs> a few others I can't remember. Yeah, and I- I remember, uh, back in primary school, we did, like, a bunch of, um, lessons about Greek mythology. So we got to learn about, like, uh, Achilles' heel, uh, uh, we learned about, like, the Trojan horse, um, Oh, there was, there was like other stuff. That was the the whole uh, the story of Medusa. We we got to learn a bunch of stuff. Those, uh, oh yeah, the Minotaur, Theseus and the Minotaur. I think his name was God of War. Game. This is fun. I guess I have never played God of War. And you are Stella. Stella. Welcome, Stella. I see you have brought a friend here with you. What's his name? Daffodil, I see. You two will share the burden then, and take it over from me. As I said in a few minutes, I will be gone from this world. And that is why you are here. You will be the new spirit Pharaoh. Listen, your task here will be far from easy, but simple nonetheless. Go fetch the stray spirits stranded on the islands, and when they are ready, bring them back here. Dying souls can't pass away on their own. You will have to help them fulfill their last requests and be at their service until their last breath. Uh, in isolation VR looks so scary but i don't own a vr i yeah i don't own a vr i've mm, i'm not really isn't alien isolation a horror game i'm i'm not really one for certain horror games i don't know stuff like faith like i absolutely love faith i i will absolutely play that but um i don't know alien isolation doesn't do it for me same like with uh like resi evil uh not really for me no consent for this, better have good pay for this secret. And I mean, to be fair, they're dead. What, what, what else are they gonna do? Okay. The big round bridge over there is the Everdor. The Alpha, where everything starts. The Omega, where everything ends. This is where all the quests get completed and where existence meets its threshold. That's so pretty. The art in this game already looks so pretty. There is no task more important than this one. Never forget this, Stella. But here is something I need to give you. Oh? Ooh? Nani? Now, be really careful with it. It is the Everlight. The symbol of your status here and the only tool you will ever need. Wait, what are you? Oh, how highly in inappropriate. Oh, <laughs> no, that's so cute. Well, that settles it. The Avalite will help you through your travel. <laughs> It will be the light that shines in the darkness, the last remaining hope of the departed. Ooh. Ooh. Nice! Hope is a flame, the light the light that never falters, the beacon of eternity. It is heavy and inconvenient, but there is no greater duty than this one. Oh, yeah, how's the how's the game audio? Is it loud, quiet? Uh, l let me let me know, and I'm, I'll up it if I need to. Because it, it is reading a little low on my end uh, for you guys, but I don't I don't know. The fate of lost souls rests on your shoulders. Look, I was overwhelmed too at first. Just try to keep your focus. Take it one step at a time. You'll soon get used to this place. 
accustomed to these moments. You are the new spirit bearers after all. Uh oh, one last thing. Once I am gone, you will have to find a ship of your own. Mine is not suited for you and it will fade away once I am gone. You might find one not too far from here if you keep rowing in the right direction for some time. Probably. It's time. Here I go. So long, Stella. And good luck. You will need it. Oh. Bye, Charon! Oh, hi, cat! Hello! Oh. oh! I... This game looks so beautiful. <laughs> I love the loading animation! Oh my god! <laughs> Oh, right off the bat, okay. Uh, okay, it's still ASD. Pre hold, press spacebar to jump, hold spacebar to jump higher. Okay. Hmm, am I, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna switch to controller. Let me, let me try this with the controller. Hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah, there we go. Let me go up here. There we go. Hold uh, D up while jumping to climb through platforms. Hold down and A to drop down. Oh, control stick. Okay. Right here. Oh, I messed that up. I, I jumped too far down. There we go. Over here. How do I, uh, B? Nothing. Stella. Hmm, that's the wrong button. It's, oh, okay, it's, it's X to interact. That's a weird button. Hi, Sam. Hello, welcome in. Stella. It really is you. Stand up straight and let me get uh, let me get a good look at you. Hmm. You look good. And Daffodil is here too, I see. I'll have to find a lint roll then. <laughs> ah, it might not be that obvious after all. It's me, Gwen. Good thing you found me. But if you're here, it means... Oh. You are the new spirit fairer. You are the one replacing Charon. I was trying to rid him and only and I was trying to get rid of him and only ended up here by accident. I've been stuck on this disgusting island for a, about a week living off sardines and cigarettes. Yeah. Where my throat? Wait, it it did throw, didn't it? I I I heard it throw. It might have just hit a uh, a target just off of me. Then I'm blind. Yeah, cuz it throw definitely works. See? It might have been a big object and it bounced just off a screen. That might have been it, maybe. Funny how I used to be the one getting you out of trouble before. Oh, we comes, it didn't reach, yep. I can see you have an Everlight now. Mm. Of course, I see that, see that boat over there? How am I doing? I'm doing good. Uh, I'm starting up this new game and I'm trying not to think about how much work I need to do for uh, mm. for my next outfit debut. That's the one! Mm. Spirit Fairer, the Dark Souls of emotional games? What does that mean? <laughs> Hi, Kiaren. It's obviously slightly shabby, but let's com uh, commandeer it. Th thanks, Yeti. <laughs> Thank you for the hundred. See that boat? No, we didn't see the giant boat right next to us. I'd wait. Uh! Thanks, cat. <laughs> <You can't. laughs> 
<laughs> it just reminds me of uh, the other day when I was on Mara's stream and she had the uh, the the bits redeems uh, that basically like make stuff appear on screen and I did I, I said think fast chuckle nuts and proceeded to flashbang chat. <laughs> I need I need to get the uh, the tango was it, was it called tango stuff because I remember seeing uh, I saw Al have it because she had also had like the the AI voice thing. Tangia, that's it. I knew it wasn't Tango or whatever. <laughs> oh, I wanted to say something else, but then I realized, no, that is definitely not it. And I was... Only the cultured will know. <laughs> uh, but, uh... Ah, uh, I'll... I'll, uh... I'll definitely look into Tangia. Because that, that feels interesting. I'd wager it will work since you're the spirit fairer. Okay, meet me on the deck over there. I'll explain it all. Okay. I, l I, l I like it. Oh. Oh, that's cool. <gasps> no double jump, but still I get to. Oh, that's sick. <laughs> I, I, I love that. He's my little kitty. I love that. Bell? <laughs> okay, let's go. Over here. Okay, here goes. Hope my fur coat won't be too damaged. Ooh. <gasps> Ooh. Oh. oh, wonderful. I'm not one to jump for joy, but this feels good. Much better than anticipated. So, the way I see it, this boat is yours now. Well, I'm going to uh, have fun playing games. Thanks, Sam. Thank you for popping in. <laughs> Thanks for throwing stuff at me. Don't you think? Good. And as you're the spirit fairer, welcoming stray spirits is your new job. And once aboard, they'll assume their true forms. Mm. Well, it's my theory anyway. Why are you looking at me like that? Mm. You need to come here and give me a hug. <gasps> I get to give people hugs? Oh my god! Mm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> oh! Oh, that's so cute. Much better. Come with me now. Let's take a look at this chaos. Oh my god! Oh! I need a hug! Oh no! <laughs> oh? What a mess. Reminds me of Aunt Petunia. Old Yard. Aunt Petunia's Old Yard. Aunt, aunt, I'll say aunt. A beautiful, unorganized testament to someone's laziness. Mm. Or a vital impossibility to get rid of anything. At any rate, we should do something about this or my dust allergies will be back. Let me think. Mm. There's only one way to clean this up. You have to meet Albert. Oh, thank you for the hydrate. He's your local shipwright, and his jokes are garbage. <laughs> but he's the only one who can fix your boat. We should head to Albert's shipyard. You must be wondering how to make the ship move. It's really easy, actually. Uh, it's really easy, actually. There, let me let me give you this key I found on the island. It will unlock that cabin in the back. You should find a map projector in there. How do I know all this? Well, I was planning an escape, remember? And you know me, I plan things meticulously. Very meticulously. Go, open up the cabin, Stella. The map projector should be simple enough to use, and you just have to go to Albert's shipyard. Okay. Uh, cabin, cabin, cabin. Press. Oh god, is that? Okay, that's minus. It's always a wonder what that button will be 
on the the pro controller because uh, I feel like most people don't know how to fucking map it. Okay. Nope, that's uh. There we go. Oh, there we go. Unlocked it. Uh, ooh, ooh, nice little comfy bed. That's nice. Okay. Albert Shipyard, Alt Arbor. Okay. Is that? Yep. There we go. Set sail, Captain. Stella. That's me. As I understand, the ship is powered by your Everlight. That's how it cruises ocean and reveals the stray spirits. It also explains why I couldn't do anything by myself. I, I, you must admit, it's quite fascinating. Look, I know you must feel overwhelmed. Charon, the Evador, the Spirit Fairies, this place, this boat, me being here. It's a lot. You must be wondering what's going on. Truth be told, I don't really know either, but I'm here for you. I'll do my best to help you try make sense of it all. As I said earlier, I wanted to leave by myself, but somehow I just couldn't. Now that I see you, I think I know why. I'll give you some space for now. Don't hesitate to explore the ship. You can even give that fishing rod a try. The world is your oyster. Oh boy, fishing. Where's? Oh, there's a nice deck chair here. Okay. Okay. How how does this work? Come on. Bring them in. Oh, one herring. Come on. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on. Ooh. Oh, really? Okay. Another herring. But it looks like we're already almost here. Hmm. Whoa. Oh, God, this place is a mess. But hey, there it is the shipyard. There we go. Whoa, Albert Shipyard discovered. Nice. Ooh. Yes, here we are. Now head down to Albert Shipyard and upgrade your blueprint station. It's the only way to clear this clutter. I'm curious what it's all made of. Considering the smell, I'd say at least seven different types of dirt and dust. <laughs> Okay, so that. Oh, over here! Welcome to my shipyard, young traveler. Where my prizes are, a customer's best friend. I'm Albert. That voice is gonna kill me. Been here, been in the business for shipbuilding for ages. Should I assume you are the new spearfarer? Oh, of course you are. <laughs> I can't keep that up. Anyway, you've been able to start the ship and bring it here after all. Gwen was right to point you towards my humble enterprise. <laughs> Let me see what you have here. Nice little dinghy. Funny how it looks exactly like the one I've built some time ago and stored in my old shipyard. See, Karen was unhappy about his gloomy and dank arc. Actually, he was always complaining about everything, but the customer's always right, so I built him a newer, better one. Of course, he would never abandon his previous boats. Old habits die hard. But don't worry, you can keep this one. Let's just call this alone. And let me tell you something. You know we always joke about the construction here. Don't worry. We're still working on it. Anyway, with this little bit of love, this bird will be resplendent again. The first thing you'll need is a proper blueprint table. Since it's your lucky day, I'm feeling generous. I'll offer it to you. Free of charge. 
Mind you, it's just a bit bare bones in terms of functionality. But in the subsequent upgrades will come at such a small price, you'll want to buy them almost immediately. Simply direct me to upgrade the ship. Ooh. Ah. Uh, yes. Okay. You'll be able to build and edit your buildings on the boat. What a treat. But if you really want to upgrade your boat in size and in pleasure, I'm your guy. Come back when you feel your boat is getting too crowded. Cheers. Oh, nice. So do I... I'm guessing I go back, but I wanna... Oh. I can... I can hop in the water. I should probably get out. Eh, I'll be fine, I'm sure. Okay, back in we go. Back to the boat we go. Finally. Good. Albert gave it you for free? And he said he loaned the ship to you. Ominous. Hard to know what he has in mind, but it doesn't sound reassuring. Anyways, let's focus on the task at hand for now. Cleaning up this deck. You can go to your new blueprint table above your cabin and select the move option. In it, you'll be able to remove any building and get back resources. Go for it. I'll wait down here. Can I give a hug? Sorry, I'm okay now. Aww. I wanted to give a hug. Mm. Oh. It's all this. Jellyfish stage L? Mm-hmm. Okay. What is this fairy boating sim? No, it's it's a uh, undead collect uh undead resource management game. Okay, what did it say? Look at your blueprint station above your cabin. Ah, here. Okay. Edit. Salvage. Yes. Ooh, okay. Cause <laughs> she doesn't. Yeah, no, I basically, uh, actually, I, even I don't know. <laughs> Even I don't know much about what's going on at the moment. Okay, give me, give me a second. Uh, Homest is pinging me. Homest. Homestead of his picking. Eh, I can't speak. Okay, there we go. Oh, there we go. But uh, ba uh, the way Kiaran described it is that it's the Dark Souls of um, <laughs> emotional games. So that's that's reassuring. <laughs> Wonderful. You did a wonderful job, Stella. And the good news is that you have enough resources to add a guest house to your ship. A necessary amenity. Newly welcome spirits such as myself will have a temporary place to relax and sleep. Well, sleep, not really. I can tell you for sure that no one will be thrilled to spend more than one night in there. But it be sleeping on the deck. The stars are pretty, but the wood is stiff and the humidity is hard to tolerate. I'll leave it to you. Have fun. It's fine, I'm an expert at crying. Ah. <laughs> Good to know. Hmm, set sail. Uh, build the guest house with the blueprint table. Okay. Yeah, the way that, um... The way that the game was uh, described it, uh, on Steam was like cozy, uh, cozy resource management uh, in the afterlife or something. And you know what? That that seems interesting. <laughs> sure, sure. We'll go with. 
We'll go with that. Enjoy! Look at it! Look at it! Very nice! The guest house is very pretty. It has your touch. Nice work as usual. Now, at last, I have a place to sit down and enjoy the view. Oh, wait. What's going on? Something else is happening. Ah, I should have expected this. I'm actually hungry. Very hungry. You know how terrible a cook I am, but I remember you being absolutely fantastic at it. And you might have f f fished a few fishes already. Trouble is, I can't eat an entire raw fish. I could try for sure, but I'll probably choke on the fishbone and never survive. That's not how you want me to go. As absurd as this sounds. So you should keep using this blueprint table of yours and build a kitchen aboard. I'm pretty sure I've seen the plans for it in there. As well as the necessary resources. Damn. You require bright jelly. And there's only one way to get some. I... I should have told you when I first met you here. Something scares the hell out of me. A dark presence and even I cower from it. This guy needs sushi. Uh, she's a gal. Uh, her name is Gwen and she is lovely. She is my mother. Uh, or at least I'm, 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 I'm adopting her as a mother figure. <laughs> a void that swallows all light included. It can take many forms, and for me, it is always jellyfish. Yes, I'm fully aware of the irony. The bright jellyfish you need for the kitchen. Well, only these jellyfish can provide it for you. So, there is no other option. I'll have to face my fears. <laughs> Daffodil! <laughs> I love daffodils a bit. But you're here. With you, I can do it. They'll appear as a dark patch of pure fear on your map, so you can't miss it. Go. I'll take some time to prepare myself. Oh. Go hunt down some jellyfish. It was over here, right? Yeah. We stand right there breaking down dear gender norms. Mm hmm. Oh, that light is so pretty. Oh my god. Look at that. That's so cool. Oh, I love it. Let me, let me, let me say hi. Can I, can I give you a hug? Aw. Mm -hmm. Mood? Okay. Hungry. I'll I'll do a bit more fishing. I come on, come on, come on. Go. Whoa, whoa! I like the the fishing in this game. It's very nice and simple compared to. Ooh, oh, another herring. <laughs> We'll do, we'll do like a, a bit of fishing while we've got nothing else to do, so might as well, you know? Come on, come on. Whoop. No herring? Uh oh. That's worrying. Uh, Stella? Stella? <laughs> Not Stella, uh, Gwen. Damn, here they come. Remember, set your eyes on the ones with bright jelly. They should be visible enough. That said, pop as many as you can. You'll get a glimpse anyway. I'll wait for you inside. It's just too hard for me to stay out there. Okay, go ahead. I believe in you. Wait, how how am I meant how am I meant to fight? What? How how, how am I meant to, to fight them? Oh. Oh. So they do give me stuff. Oh, this is so cool. 
come on. Oh, I probably need to go higher up here. That'll help. Ooh, the big one coming. 25 glims. Oh, wow. Okay, I can just stand here. Get a bunch here. Mm hmm. Okay, bright jelly. Times two. Oh, we got more bright jelly on the way. Oh my god. So many jellyfish. Okay. I'm gonna just stand here, grab a bunch here. Okay. Nice, nice. What's Glim gonna read? Um, maybe it's the currency? And why... Oh. Fantastic! Ooh. Okay, I'm really impressed. You rocked out. You rocked out there, tumbling and diving like a shooting star, and without the slightest fear nor hesitation at that. You definitely haven't lost your touch, Stella. And you even gathered enough bright jelly to build a proper kitchen. Go for it. I'll be patiently waiting, slowly digesting myself. No, Gwen, no. Okay, let's uh, blueprints. Nope, didn't mean to. Oh! I can pet the cat. I can. I can. Oh. How are the spirits faring? The spirits are faring great. Rain. Look. Oh my god. My heart. My my day is made. My day is made. Okay, so I need a kitchen. Oh, there we go. Kitchen. Kitty people, yes. <laughs> I am very people happy at that. I am very, I am very people happy. Lovely kitchen. I love that. <sighs> I love that you can pet the cat. You can feather cat. You can now use the kitchen's oven. It should be rather simple, but put any one ingredient in the oven and wait for it to be cooked. You could even try these loose corn kernels that have been hanging around my pockets. I can't wait to see you in your cooking glory again. You got this. Ooh. Cook. Mm. Yeah, we'll cook. Uh... We'll cook the herring. Okay, what do while I wait? Stella? Oh? Ah, yes! I forgot to tell you about this. As you can see, this boat stops at night. I believe it's a side effect of your Everlight being, well, light. Or rather, some other technicality. Yeah. That being said, it will allow people to sleep undisturbed. You, in the meantime, can do anything you want. Tackle unfinished business or just chill on the deck under the stars. I suggest you go to sleep too in that cozy little room atop your cabin. You'll wake up refreshed and ready to go and the ship will start up again in the morning. Oh, and talking about that. You know me, waking up on time has never been my forte. You can ring that bell over there to wake people up. Remember, only do it at the right time. Early morning should do the trick. Speaking of which, time for me to take a nap. See you tomorrow, Stella. Have a good night. Okay. I I made I made I made you food. Okay, I, I guess you can have it in the morning. I'll Sure. Yeah, we'll we'll sleep till morning and hope that the kitchen doesn't burn down. I asked my Everlight not. That was- it was explained in the beginning, Rin. Uh, the Everlight is the- the light around... Oh. I hope that's not the kitchen on fire. The Everlight is the... Uh... 
It's the light around the the cat's uh, neck and my uh, my belt. Okay. <laughs> Whoa, grillfish. Good morning. I could eat anything. Just give me some food. Food. Well, I won't die just yet. Thanks, Stella. It's better than I, uh, I could. It's better than I thought it could be. But then again, you've always been a wonder in the kitchen. Don't forget, spirits don't run on sunshine and water. We need a good meal once in a while. It'll be up to you to understand who's fond of what. As for me, I'm sure you remember, I've always loved comfort food. And that would, I would die for a cup of coffee. But I'm not that picky. I can eat anything. Just never the same thing twice. Oh, and before I forget, here is something I was supposed to give you. I'm not sure exactly how it works, but an obol is a symbol of passage. It's a fee each spirit has to pay you. But something tells me you already knew that. Okay, let's keep on improving this craft. As you must have seen in the blueprint table, there is both a field and a garden blueprint, which means you can grow many different things and turn the ship into an adorable farm of sorts. I run on sunshine and water. I run on hopes and dreams. <laughs> you should add a field first, in my opinion. It's going to be easier to find the resources for it uh, around here and you can grow linen in it oh yeah should i should i up the the audio is it is it quiet is it too quiet which in turn will be used to craft more things in addition to building a field we should go buy seeds to use it in using it but that will come later i need you to visit an island close by i run a trip Banned. Banned. I think I think I'll up the audio a little. I feel like maybe it's a bit hard to hear. Uh, yeah, I imagined so. Okay, how's that? Is that is that better? It's called Mostine Cove, and there's something on it we need. I'll tell you when we get there. Oh? Seagull. Uh, in here, and then... Go grab these. Okay, leave. And in the meanwhile, we do Appy's favorite pastime fishing. Can't ban me, I am powerful and beautiful. Uh only one of those things are true. And it's 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 not powerful. I uh, believe me, you are powerless in my chat. You you hold no strength here. What could you possibly do to harm me, little fox? Hmm? What can little fox here do? Hmm? Tell me. Tell me, little fox, what can you do? It's more than I've got <laughs> ever gone. <laughs> Still a compliment, I'll take it. I uh, sure. Come on, fight. Oh, crates. Uh oh. Hi, hi, I'm here. There we go. Oh, good, good stuff. <laughs> I just realized, look at Daffodil, look, look at Daffodil. <laughs> oh my god, it's so cute. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I love that. Okay, let's hop back on. I love Daffodil so much. Oh my god, it's so precious. 
Okay, so let's go in here. And then we'll sail... Mostine Cove. Give me a sec, I'll show you exactly what I can do. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Uh-uh. I, I love it. Parkour. 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 Pet the cat. Give the give the lizard pets. I love I love the art style. Have I mentioned that? I love the art style. Yeah, I love no. I love no little baby. I love my little baby. Don't be rude. Who, me? I, I love the cat. The kitty cat. What's well, so hi, Austin. Hello, welcome in. Okay, let's do some more fishing. Mm. Come on. Give us a bite. <laughs> oh, old shoe. Oh, boy. We're encountering the... The, the junk portion of fishing. <laughs> Getting the true Animal Crossing experience now, huh? God, I... I... I don't miss the... Actually, no, I do miss the days off when I would fish in Animal Crossing. Oh, God, more shoes. Oh? Mostine Cove. Discovered. Ooh. Oh. We should hop on that island over there. Maybe we'll find something interesting. Let's go! Those sessions were good. They were. I... Oh. <laughs> you think I am powerless, silly dragon? Foolish one, I am stronger than you can ever imagine. Who do you think you're talking to? I'll tell you who. I am the power. I am the fury. I am rain. <laughs> Good job. Good job, Ryan. Good job. Thank you. Think of it 13 months. Oh my god. Oh my god, that was great! Oh? Oh! I'm in Why did you do that then? What a majestic tree! Well, we can cut it down. Yes, it's fine, I promise. It's the best way to get the wood you need, actually. But don't worry. They'll regrow all the time. Another interesting fact about the Everlight. Oh? Oh my god! <laughs> it was on auto charge? It was. Ah, oh, okay. Well done. Congratulations. But you've become Death, the destroyer of worlds. Wool. Joke, jokes aside, that's how you do it. You go on ahead, cutting down more trees. Then we can go back to the boat and build the field with all those maple logs. I'll be next to the raft. Thanks, Gwen. Oh, berries. As in no one can, because he's not. Mm, he turned himself into a sore funniest thing I have ever... Banned. Banned. Okay, I can't cut down any of you. So I just have to go onwards here and you. Let's go. This is much nicer on control, I will say. Ooh. 
Nice. And then, is there anything up here? Up over this way. Ooh. Oh my god. Mining? Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, I see. Oh, okay, that's interesting. That's cool. Limestone. Is that... Okay, that's the end of that area. Oh, can I, can I get back up? There we go. Uh, I don't know if there's anything else around here. I don't think there is. Okay. I guess we go back to the raft then. The music's nice. It's very, it's very low key. Very, very calming. A grape squirted down my throat and made me choke earlier and I can still feel it. That seems like a skill issue, buddy. Stan. <sighs> it's always interruptions during stream, huh? It's, it's always interruptions during stream. I'm gonna be right back. <sighs> Well, uh, hold on, let me, let me, how do I pause? There we go. Hey, be right back. Hello, I'm back. Oh, the game. Hmm, the game did that. Uh, hold on. There we go, it's back. Oh, okay, I can save and quit at any time. That's, that's good, that's good. It's good to know that it's not, like, uh, save restricted to certain points. Okay, let's go. Is there a wrong button? Let's go. Okay, what do you... Oh. I didn't mean to sit down. I wanted to talk to you. Don't ask me how, but I've all, I've met Albert already. He definitely is a shark, but his interest is all things 
uh, maritime will be helpful. Such as the boat upgrades he sells are outrageously high price. With those, you'll be able to cross ominous weather barriers in the world. They look like classic mythical challenges again. A bit cliche if you ask me. Hmm, what was I? Oh, the... Hmm... Field. Oh! Oh, okay, that's... Hmm. Okay. Interesting. Hmm. Uh, edit. So if I put that there, and then move the kitchen up here, sure. Field. Uh, ha! It's better looking than I thought. Has a little je ne sais quoi to it. Simple, but elegant. Mm -hmm. Now, all you have to do is plant field seeds in there. Seeds can grow only in their respective places. The garden seeds won't grow in the field, so don't bother trying. Mm -hmm. You know, but you know me. I would kill a plastic cactus, so don't take my word on this. Anyway, there's only one place where we could possibly find what we need. Theodore specializes in seeds. He has set up shop he has set up shop in Hummingburg, the busiest town of the area. Theodore and his brother are founders of Raccoon Inc., a shady retail franchise with very loose moral values. Yes, this world is has a serious problem of dubious business practices. Mm -hmm. Since I don't want you to get swindled, I'll come with you and do most of the talking. I've run into this cheeky little raccoon once and his dishonesty was blatant. Let's head to Hummingburg then. Mm -hmm. We just need to find some seeds for that field. Okay, so she's headed off to bed. Hmm. She doesn't like to eat the same thing twice. Actually, wait, let me... Uh, let me start planting some stuff. No, that's the door. Okay, let's start planting. Uh, co coffee bean seeds. She likes coffee beans, so we'll do that. Mm hmm Okay, and then we'll do more coffee. Uh, I hope I don't drown these. Okay, and then some corn. Water you. And leave. Okay, let's cook something up. Ah, uh, right. Oh, hmm. Meals type healthy. Uh, sure. Let's cook one of you. Yeah. Yeah, we'll give that in the morning. We'll just, we'll let it sit overnight and then we'll give it in the morning. Because <laughs> what could, what could go wrong? Okay, beige time. Sleep until morning? Yes. We sleep until morning. Okay. Oh. Okay, time to ring the bell and wake up everyone. Beak stretch. Uh, bell. Right, wakey, wakey, wake, wakey, wakey. It's time for school. Wake up. 
oven mitts. Take that out. Ooh, popcorn. Well, well. A snack would be great right about now. Let's give you... Comfort snack. Oh, thank you, Stella. I love comfort food so damn much. <gasps> Yay! Happy up! Okay, let's water everything. Because I do not want this stuff to die. Please and thank you. Okay. And then next up, we deal with... Oh, new location. Ooh. More jellyfish? Yep, jellyfish stage two. Hummingbird. Yes. Okay, onwards we go. Let's do some fishing. What can we see? What can we get? Let's find out. Come on, something bite. Something, please. Please. Ooh. Ooh. Herring. Okay. Oh, Stella. Hi, Gwen. You know, I'm delighted that you're here with me, but I'm not surprised one bit. It adds up. You here taking care of me in my final hours. You've always cared so damn much about others. Always protected those you found vulnerable. Even pedantic snobs like me. Remember the day my father yelled at the cat? We just got out of elementary school. You were wearing those blue sneakers with glittery tags. And there you were, yelling back at my father like you were on a mission. Father turned red and smashed the purple... Delena vase? It was red. <laughs> oh. Uh, what's your stats looking like? Uh, what? Shops with fibers. Shops with threads. Uses the loom. Oh, are we nearly there? Oh, we are. We're here. Hummingbird discovered. Okay. Where are we? Alright. Oh. We're here. Let's buy some seeds. Theodore has set up a shop in this island. Let's pay him a visit. Ooh. Seeds for the future. What is on my glasses? My glasses are dirty. Why? I do not know. Ooh. Oh. There's a lot here. I love the cheese in the background. Give me a sec. Oh. Eepy, dra dragon is eepy. Okay. Hmm. Oh, hi there. Yeah, I hope my next game will be ready soon. I've crunched the data and spent five nights theory crafting. Clearly, if you take the heavy weapon proficiency from Mountain Gnome Race, there is a nifty synergy with level 3 rogue ability to eviscerate. <laughs> oh my god, where's Appy when you need him? <laughs> I found! He's in the game! <laughs> this is for sure a bit weird, but hey, 5d20 and also crit on board can't be defeated, am I right? That's, that's just Appy. That's, that's just Appy. That's just Appy. Oh my god. I'm I'm clipping that. I'm gonna send that to him later. Oh. I'm out here looking for the right house to start family. My wife sent me out to find something that might fit our needs. A garden. Maybe a pool. Oh. I'm not asking for much. I just can't decide. I know that you can't help me, but it helps to say it out loud. Oh. I might stumble on the rarest finds. Okay, never mind. What are you on about? Oh? A stroll a day keeps the doctor away, which reminds me, I haven't been to the doctor in forever. 
Oh no. Why are you acting about health all of a sudden? Am I suddenly starting to feel unwell? I'm not sick. I'm okay. Yeah. Take a good look at this shrine, Stella. It's simply stunning. Once a wife and wants to start a family that can't be happy. No, that was a different guy. Those are two different people. One of them was a D&D nerd that wanted a uh, D&D. The other one was uh, someone who wanted a house with his wife. Those were two different people. It's simply stunning. Some objects in this world are meant to resonate with the spirit fairer and the Everlight. Mm -hmm. I've heard this mo monument has the power to enhance the Everlight's abilities. Mm -hmm. The two slots on it need to be filled up. I'm fairly certain you could use orbals to activate it. But to get orbals, you need to welcome more spirits on your ship. Mm. I'm sure you'll find more lost souls like me. Oh, oh I have one. Mm. Yes? Oh, I thought you had something to say. I simply adore your hat. Our local shop, Raccoon Inc., only carries garbage worms, <laughs> seeds, logs, rocks, all useless items. I need me a hat like yours. Yeah, I hope my next game will be ready soon. For today's turn, okay. <laughs> that really is just happy, huh? Okay, let's... Aww. Davy. Hello, Davy. Oh, let me guess. I'm a bit of a psychic, you know? Your name is Mary or Margaret. It's Missy. Wait, no. Esh. Don't tell me it's. Oh, shoot. I'll get it someday. My favourite spot is this bench at the end of the pier. It's beautiful and quite peaceful. After a long day's work. Oh my! I shouldn't have told you if I wanted to keep it that way. Yep, sorry buddy, that's how it works. I'm sorry, I'm in a bit of a rush. I'm busy, miss. I'm going home. Don't follow me. Please. I hate it when people know where I live. If you know my address, you'll tell people. And they'll tell people. Listen. Just don't- I just don't want junk mail. Oh, good? There's Theodore. Go ahead and take a look at what he's selling. Oh? Uh -huh. Let's talk. Step right up, potential prospect. Welcome to Raccoon Inc. We've been servicing hum hummingbird since forever. You've got the glimpse, I've got the goods. We, I, I've got all the wares you, uh, to make you spend all those hard-earned glims. Step right up. Oh. Oh my God. I op opens the door next to the broken ladder in Hummingburg and that's 500,000. Okay. Okay, buddy. Um. What was that? Those prices are out of control. I don't let him get away with this. Are you ready for me to obliterate this much? <laughs> Good. Let's do this. Theodore. I know what you're doing here, and you should be ashamed of yourself, you trash panda. Mm -hmm. People like you are the reason we have middle fingers. Abby! We were just talking about you. We found the D&D &D nerd. <laughs> <laughs> what? Madam, what's the meaning of this? My friend here is the new spirit fairer, but she's not a newbie. And neither am I. That little scam of yours won't work on us. B but I... I can assure you my business practices are quite above uh, board. Be warned, you treacherous striped weasel. I won't tolerate this behavior one more second. Who is the D&D nerd? I'll, I'll show you in a sec. No more shenanigans, no more double crosses. Just 
unfair prices. Hi. Hi. So stop being dishonest at once. And next time I see you, I'll try being nicer. If you start being smarter. Got it? Blood. Yes. Yes, of course. I, I promise you, I'll adjust my prices. I beg you, please don't scold me anymore. I'll even give you a discount. Hey, you. Yes, you. Your friend really gave that greedy merchant some hell. You both look like you could possibly join the upstairs crew. You want to come up, don't you? I can see it in your eyes. I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty cool being up here. And yeah, all the best people are up here. Don't get too excited, though. Some idiot broke the ladder. You have to be able to jump in humanely high to make it. I guess you could also use the stairs in that house, but some other idiot lost the key. Well, anyway, see ya. Upstairs crew forever. Ah. Uh, okay, the the D and D nerd. Uh, we're going over here. Where are you? You were over here somewhere. You. Yeah, I hope my next game will be ready soon. Happy you here. Just wanna double up. Uh, I've crunched the data and spent five nights theory crafting. Clearly, if you take the heavy weapon proficiency from the mountain gnome race, there is a nifty synergy with the level three rogue ability eviscerate. Uh, it's for sure a bit weird, but hey, 5d20 and auto crit on prone can't be defeated, am I right? <laughs> yeah, that was that, that was a D&D nerd I was talking about. Have you have you played this game before? <laughs> Okay, that's more reasonable. No, I think that's what happened. Play it. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's... <laughs> oh my god. Carrot seeds and linen seeds. I don't remember much of the plot. Ah, okay. 70 per. I'm gonna need to bully some jellyfish. Fantastic. If you've got everything you need, I'll take my leave. Feel free to stay here as long as you want. I'll meet you at the pier. Okay. Uh, oh, that's lots. Okay. Is there a secret cave here? Hmm. Wait, can I can I jump? No, I can't jump on your stall, sadly. Yeah, so far I'm liking it. The game is pretty. It's very pretty. I need to make my way back though. Hi. Oh. Are you hungry? Oh. Thanks. I love it. Okay. Let's go back to the boat. I got everything we need. Okay. Oh, why did the game minimize itself? Hold on. Looks great. Way ahead of me, Stella. Your thumb is as green as your hat. The boat will soon become a cozy floating farm. Don't forget that you'll probably have to water the plants once in a while. Don't ask my word for it though. My garden knowledge is as limited as my father's empathy. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> You'll have to find better mentors than me. Which reminds me. I believe it's time for you to find new people. Not that I don't love the idea of just the two of us cruising the oceans. But you are the spirit fairer. And spirit fairers find spirits. And yes, help them fulfill their last wishes, however mundane they can be. I've heard of a place not far from here where someone might be in need of your help. And I bet You'll like this one if he is who I think he is. Go. Let's sail. Oh. Okay, so where I want to head is... Ooh. I want to head here because there's some good resources here. And then we'll head to the jellyfish flock. Yeah, 
I'll 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 ride this until we hit uh pure night time and it tells me to go to bitch. Ooh. Oh yeah, Abby, I think you'd like this game. There's fishing in it. It's resource management and fish well no. Yeah, no, yeah, I'd say resource management. Really? <laughs> I knew I knew the fishing would get him. Okay, let's go bitch. Also, 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 hold on. I need to I need to show you this one so I wake up again. Look at Look at look at this. This is so cute. This is so cute. I can pet Daffodil. This is so cute. <laughs> I love I love this game. Okay, wakey wakey. Oh, I, I should water these things. Oh. Let's go. We got coffee. I'm in love him. Fish fish. Good morning, Stella. Good morning, I'll get your coffee right away. Cook uh, the coffee beans, yes. Let's go, we get the coffee. Black coffee. Nope, I didn't mean to do that. Sure. I'll pet the cat. Down. Uh, food. You want this? Oh, you're not hungry right now. Okay. Oh. Stuff here. What are you? Oh, shiny, vibrant necklace. Okay. Oh, that's interesting. Also, look, look at look at daffodil. Look how daffodil's not falling in. <laughs> look at what daffodil's doing. It's so cute. It's so adorable. Oh my god, I love this game. Okay, let me let me get out the water. I I love daffodil. Plant it in the field. Yeah, plant you. Plant more corn. Plant more coffee. Oh, and it actually tells you when to water them. That's cool. Okay, moisten the dirt. Nice. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna prep some more food for when it's needed. Um, oh, don't say low battery, please. What's, what happens if we cook these? What happens? Let me, let me also put my phone to charge. I don't need it to die midstream. Okay. Oh my god, it can be a yo-yo! It's so cool! Oh, I forgot to set the navigation path. Whoops. Hold on. I was meant to set this to over here. I wanted to go here because, oh, this event's so cool. Okay, is it nearly done? Yeah, it's nearly done. Are you hungry yet? I made your favorite. Mm -hmm. Oh. Can I give you a hug? <gasps> oh, I can give a hug. I can give a hug. Mm -hmm. Feeling much better. Oh. <laughs> Yay! Poached fruit. Ooh. Okay, we're nearly there. She'll probably head indoors. Again. Here we are again. The jellyfish is stealing all the light. 
the stolen all hope for me. I'll never get used to it. It's part of me makes feel it's all my fault. All right, you can do your thing again. Are you up for it? Yeah. Don't be scared, Stella. They'll be coming straight for us. That's fine. I can handle this. God, this is so cool. Hopefully they won't actually attack me this time. Oh my god, they are so high up. Oh, I need a double jump if I want to do any of this. Oh god, I'm missing out on all the, the good the goodies. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, I'm, I'm probably gonna have to parkour on the roof. Oh god, don't fall down. Okay, there we go, I got you. I need bright jelly, that's all I need. Oh hey, they're coming from below. I missed the big one, no I didn't. Oh my god, I'm a gamer, I swear. Man, I missed a bunch of them. It's fine though, there's a there's another patch I can grab from how many how many glims does that put me at? Uh why? Only three hundred, that's hmm. You used to find guardians in another life. It no longer has any. You should be sold. Okay. So I'm gonna go back to the lovely raccoon boy. Yeah. Are you hungry yet? Can I feed you? Now this is one damn fine cup of coffee. I've had, I can't tell you how many cups of coffee in my life, but this certain, this is certainly my favorite of them all. Thank you very much. Oh, thank you very, very much, Stella. Yay! <gasps> Ooh. Nice. Okay, now I fish because, uh-oh. Oh, okay. It stops, thank God. Okay, let's try that again, we fish. Yes, women do love me and fish do indeed fear me. Really? Why are we getting old shoes? That's all I'm guessing. Oh, we're here. We are here. Stella? Stella? We are here. Oh wait, no, this isn't. No, this is... Yeah, because they wanted to sell the necklace. Talking about Abby. <laughs> okay. Well, I am also feared by the fish, so... Okay. Oh. You're starting to annoy me. Leave my door alone. <laughs> what did I do? Okay, let's go and sell this necklace off. Uh, sell. Uh, bright jelly goes for a fair bit. <laughs> an, an odd substance that doesn't go on toast. Yeah, I, I'd hope not. Wait, where is the, where's the necklace? 
I can't sell it here. Hmm. Uh, that's 5k. Interesting. Yeah, I don't need to waste my money on the key because I just need to get one more person to join me and then uh, I can just come here and get that double jump. Okay. I'll out sell you. God, it's not, it's not even... <laughs> Hold on. Can you set the course first? It's... So, for people who don't know, um, in the UK, we have a thing called Bonfire Night, which is basically where uh, we celebrate some guy who tried to blow up the p parliament and blow up the king, but he failed. Right? He, fa he failed. And yet, uh, we, we, we celebrate that. <laughs> For whatever reason, we celebrate it there every every year on November fifth by lighting fireworks and burning effigies of the guy who tried to m make Parliament blow up. It's it's wild. It's very interesting. It's wild. It's a uh, it's 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 a very interesting time. Uh, and yeah, I don't know why though, but for some reason people just choose to have the have their fireworks go off like um um like days before the actual day <laughs> for whatever reason. I love my cat so much. I love my cat so much. Hmm. I can ring at a bell. We're nearly here. I think the closest uh, Saturday night is fair. But the thing is, bonfire night is on a Sunday, and I've been having I've been hearing fireworks since Thursday. So I uh, know something's not clicking here. Ooh. Wait, did I did I not make it to that island? I didn't know. I didn't. Good job. Good good job, me. Well, at least food's done, so I can grab that. Take it out of the oven. Grilled veggie. Ooh, delicious. Uh, prepare to all these next weeks so or Prepare for all round two. Barkshim Creek. The thing is, though, with the volley, though, it's always just on the day. Okay, it's not like you know a week leading up to it. It's rather uh, the way I've always heard it is that they've always uh, the people who do cel celebrate the volley around here. Uh, it's not like they're constantly shooting off fireworks every day of the week. You know. It's, lim uh, it's limited to a very short time. Okay. Oh, more tree. This anime is so cute. <laughs> I love that. I love. I love that Daffodil's just kind of hanging off the log, while uh, Stella's doing most of the work. <laughs> It's so cute. This game is so cute. And this is what I call uh, deforestation. <laughs> but I'm allowed because I'm the spirit pharaoh. Hmm. There we go. Oh, hey. Oh, great. You're here. Listen, I just dropped a lemon in that pond. My fingers were all sticky. It just sort of slipped. Why? 
Good question. I've been eating delicious berries all day. Look at my, look at my hands, I swear. I've been experimenting. I want to squeeze a little bit of citrus on these wild fruits. Now it's all just berries with no twist. Unless it's just down there in the water. I'll, I'll, I'll do it myself. I have these pulpy fruits to take care of. Ooh, look at... Look at... Look at Stella. Not Stella Daffodil. Okay. Dive. Oh, there is lemon. Lemon. That's the one. I just need to find a tissue or something. I don't want to get berry juice all over it. Never mind. I just hold on to that lemon for me. Don't go and squeeze it. Wait a minute. Maybe you could help me. This island is fresh out of food. My stomach's my stomach always feels empty. Maybe I could even help out aboard your ship with cooking, fishing, and building. I don't have my spices and tools, but I'll make it work. Don't think about it so much. Just, let's just go to your boat. Ooh, we got a passenger. Is there anything here? No, there is not. Okay, aboard the boat we go. I'm sure you'll need someone who could make repairs on your boat at some point. Let's go. Too dark to navigate, that's fine. We'll just talk to this lovely fella. Stella! Oh wow! This boat is amazing! Here comes the real kicker, you little rascal. Get ready for a family reunion. Oh? Frog? Oh? It's me, Stella. Your uncle, a tool. <laughs> Surprised? Happy, happily, I hope. <laughs> I've been on the island for a while now. Can't wait to see the sights. The sea. Uh, can't wait to see the sights. The sea with you. I, it was lonely with my thoughts. Now I got you, Sprout. Let's set sail for a great adventure. Onwards. Wait a second. Is, is that? Uh. uh um. Oh? What do you see? I knew it! That's a Seamaster 2000! I've actually never seen it in action. I've only heard the rumors. Apparently you can catch the biggest and brightest fish out there. Wow, Stella. You sure know how to treat yourself. Wait a darn second. You're missing a few bolts. Let me guess. You've been fishing out most of the garbage. Well, not anymore. <gasps> You'll see the difference immediately. Give it a go for a fan. Uh, give it a go for a fan. Ooh. Yeah, to be fair, I've been just catching shoes and herring, so maybe I'll maybe I'll fi finally get something good. Oh. Oh. Oh, I see. Naruhoro. I see. I I ooh <gasps> ooh squid. Ah, they never stood a chance. You sure don't mess around. This one makes you a pro. All, all this ethel fishing has gotten me rattled up. Which reminds me, I had this shiny thing in my pockets on the island. I have no idea why it does. Maybe you can hold on to it for safekeeping, I suppose. Oh, brother. I need to take a breather. Um, and by the way, you might be curious and I have already tried, but yes, the water is very salty. Uh, uh, well, I'll go and take a look around. You can fish your heart's content if you want. Uh, do you want food? I assume he wants fish. So I think I'll cook up some fish. Uh, let's see. Oh, oh god, my phone isn't charging. Oh. Okay, that's done. Uh, squid is a small cephalopod known for its taste of versatility. 
It's taste, versatility, and hostile big brother. Okay, let's cook that. And we go snooze. Sleep until morning. I need to set a, a course direction. I should probably do that. Okay. Uh, did I get... Uh, come on. Uh, yes I did, okay. We're gonna go back... Oh. Ooh. Gonna go back here. Then, there we go. Ding dong. Okay, water everything. Whoa. Hello. You've got two obols. Remember that shrine in Hummingburg? I'd try and add them there. If we're lucky, it might do something amazing. If not, you'll have wasted your time. You should go and see. Hmm. Stella, quick, come here. This is what I call a storm. Any respectable person would never let their friend get hit by lightning. But I think you should try. You have the Everlight. It'll protect you. Lightning balls will cast sparkles where they're about to hit. Rush towards those. Ah, I almost forgot. Have you got any empty bottles? If you're hit by lightning with an empty bottle, you get a lightning in a bottle. <laughs> Isn't that bananas? This world. Lightning, lightnings and bottles are pretty handy resources, so come here equipped. As a head start, here are a few bottles for you. But don't worry, they're pretty easy to come by. Get ready for the thrill of your life. Oh my god. <gasps> oh. I love. I love him. Oh my god, I love my uncle. Okay. How many bottles do I have? Ooh. Missed that one. Let's get this one. God, you get so many glims. Oh my god! Is my cat okay? I need a bottle, man. It's wild. You get so many... This is such a fun event, though. Ooh. Oh. Do I just need to get as much as I can? I think so. Yes. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, food's done. grab this squid skewer are you hungry i wasn't sure if you were going to make it for a second there you gave your old uncle quite a scare did you feel that rumble oh a rush you look pretty awesome catching those jolts of lining all over the boat thanks for being the cap the best captain i could have ever hoped for wait can, can i give you food can i give you squid Oh boy, I just love food. Keep them coming. I can't get enough of it. Really? Stomach isn't you yet. Can I give you a hug? <gasps> I give a hug. Oh, wasn't that great favorite? Wasn't that great favorite niece of mine? Oh, wasn't it? Mood. Okay. Likes everything, dislikes nothing. Oh my god, that's so cute. Okay, let me let me water this. Oh, this might be done. Yep. There we go. And you? Yes. 
plant some more corn. I should go grab some more seeds. Um, hmm, I could go for an amuse bush. You hungry? Thanks, I love it. Can I give you a hug? I can give you a hug. Okay, that's good. Feeling much better. Ah, okay. Yeah, we're still docked. I need to buy some seeds. <laughs> this will serve me well. Did I? Did I? I okay, yeah, 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 I did. How, how are we all doing on this lovely Saturday? Anyone got any interesting plans for the weekend? Because uh, my... <laughs> My, my plans are just, uh... Oh, can I sell those lightnings in the bottle? No. Oh, I can. Because, yeah, my plans is just, uh, grind away at, uh... Uh... There we go. Grind away at what I need to do. Uh, oh, right, the shrine. Uh, and also just see if it's possible for me to learn animation. And picks a lot. Acquire. Oh. Ooh. <gasps> <laughs> Daffodil so much. Oh. Nice. Oh, this feels great. And okay, now I can go up here. You made it. Wicked moves getting up here. I lied earlier, it's not so great up here. But you're here, so it might get better. I don't have a membership card for you. You'll be an honorary member of the upstairs crew. I'd show you the secret handshake, but I don't know where your hands have been. <laughs> Lame. Oh wow, there's a lot up here. Oh! <gasps> Sheep! Locked. Okay. Says crew forever. Yes, young person. I assume you're busy? Of course you're busy. Wait a second. You'll have a full service kitchen. Come back when you do. I have quite the pitch for you. Oh? Ooh. <gasps> Whoa. Uh. Hmm. Okay. Okay. You. Linen seeds. Nothing else is up there though. Uh, oh, you. My sister keeps asking me for money. How can I say no without saying no? Maybe I should ask someone to rob me. <laughs> hmm. I don't want to loan my sister money. That, yeah, that, surely that'll go well. Just, yeah, have someone rob you. That, that couldn't go. Friend? What? Oh, you gave me such a fright. That cat, he looks familiar. Daffodil? Is that you? Oh, yes, yes it is. I'm so silky, aren't you? Then that must mean... Stella, is that really you? What fantastic turns of events! And is that your boat over there at sea? You've come to rescue me again, I see. Well, not so fast. This time, I'll be, doing, I'll be the one doing the teaching. You can bet on it. Let's get going then. We have some lessons to go through. <gasps> oh, let's go! Oh, there's something for me to dive. And get uh, down an A. There we go. Oh, what's that? Citrine. Is there anything here? I don't think there is, but I'm curious. Nah, there's nothing here. 
Oh, yeah, I can just... Or not. Wow. Thought I'd be able to... Uh, get back up, but I guess not. So we'll do it all the way from here. Okay. <laughs> the sheep! Uh, can I really not sell my necklaces here? Because I... I would come under but it's just not showing there so yeah it'll be fine surely stop rattling my knob hey I already got you can I oh I can go up here don't know what's up here though Missed. <laughs> Back to the boat we go. Did I? I didn't plant anything because I didn't have anything to plant. Can I not? Huh. Okay. Over here, little one. Oh, Stella. All this air, all this open space. Yes, I feel it. I can grow quite nicely here. Look at me, I'm a flower I'm flowering already. Ooh. Oh snake Snake Oh snake Oh getting out of this chrysalis what a feeling Thank you Stella Okay let's water you Water you. Plant something here. More coffee. You can never have enough coffee. And water you. Oh. Sprout? What do you have to say? Jeez, you gotta love the sights here. The sea, the sun, the breeze on my skin. It feels so right. I'm happy to be aboard the ship with you, my niece. I wish your Aunt Vic could see you right now. Running your own ship, helping out these stranded souls. It really warms the heart. I'm glad you picked me up on that island. I'll try and make myself the least cumbersome passenger on this boat. Except for food. I'll never stop asking for delicious meals. About the garden. Oh, Stella, don't you think your boat feels a little sad? Well, it sure could use some greenery. As an added bonus, a small garden could serve as a nice classroom. I've been thinking about this teaching thing for a while now. It'll be called Care of the Plants from A to Zelia. Hmm, yeah, it doesn't ring as good once I once said out loud. Maybe I need to work on the name some more. Okay, let's see what I can do. Uh, build. What can I build? A field. A garden. But what do I have there? Oh, that's the field. Okay. Build a garden. Yeah. Mm hmm. I don't have much else that I can make. Uh, yeah. Oh, yes, perfect. What a wonderful little garden. You really outdid yourself, Stella. Oh, that makes uh, us just about ready to start the first lesson. Make sure there are some seeds in these plots. They'll be important. Okay. Uh, carrot seed, turnip seed, and uh, another carrot seed. And water these bad boys. Water all of them. Okay. For our first lesson, we'll start with something I've been quite excited to share. This world has some strange rules, as you've probably noticed already. Uh, I've 
always been a preacher for love towards all living beings. For you see, a garden is a vessel of our love, a mirror to hold to ourselves. It seems truer now than ever. Back on my island when I was lonely, I sang to the flowers. As I expected, they grew much more vigorously. Though through trial and error, I managed to write a little song. The plants seemed to react particularly well to it. I want to further test that observation with you. Go inside the garden and try playing that piece to your crops. Oh? Plantasia Fantastica. <gasps> oh my god, rhythm game. Oh my god, it's an actual rhythm game now. Okay, this- I mean, to be fair, this is actually pretty easy. Mm. This is nice. We love playing for the flowers. How long does this go on for? I'm curious- Oh my god, the thing is growing. <laughs> I just realized- uh, I can see it in the corner of my eye, the plant's actually growing. Okay. Does it- does it just keep going? Oh, I can just exit out. Okay, I did not realize that. Hold- oh. Okay, let's exit. Oh no, you're in here with me. Okay. Quite incredible. Have you seen how the plants swayed and grew as you entertained them? Isn't that fabulous? As I expected, emotions in this world manifest themselves much more vividly. Well, I'll make sure to spread the word about this fascinating discovery. And who knows? Other passengers might know how to play some music too. They might help if I'm if in a good, mo good enough mood. Which of... Speaking of which, in all the commotion of the last few days, I forgot something. Here, this is for you. A strange coin has been tickling me since I've arrived here. I'm relieved it's not the one of those pot analogies again. Uh, another opal. That's good. Are you hungry? Oh, thank you, but I'm not hungry right now. Okay, that's fine. Let's go and cook some herring. That is not... That is not cooked at all. Uh, oh, I should probably plant something to... Uh, plant. Yeah. Where is the next course gonna be? Oh, I can't even, okay. Uh, we go badge then and then we wake up and navigate. Sleep until morning. <sighs> oh, you have something to tell me. It's bell time, time to wake up everyone. Let me start navigating. Where do we navigate to? Uh, hmm. Something happening there. Oh. Sure. 
see what happens. Stella, I didn't want to disturb you with this, but for the last several weeks I've been having strange dreams. They were of a giant snake and a, of menacing reefs and a rotten fruit. And since joining your crew, well, they've been much clearer. I think it's the air of the sea, or maybe the mystical energies of the Everlight. Anyway, I'm convinced my dreams have been visions. And furthermore, I think they might be coming from our mutual acquaintance. I've been looking at the map of your cabin. My eyes keep being drawn to a specific spot that I've marked. I think we should visit. No point in making it wait. Alright, because it's raining. Ooh, there we go. Because it's raining, it was the plants all nice for me. How are you doing? Nice. And we water you, water you, and plant some more turnips. How's everyone else doing? Oh, I forgot to ring the bell. Whoops. Sorry. Good morning, Sprout. Stella. Oh. You did good. Now we've got a real boat going. You'll have to take care of these new passengers now. They'll be the ones testing your patience, not me. But before that, I have something to ask you. I have noticed by now, but sleeping in the guest house is not the ideal scenario for any of us. Especially since it's getting crowded in there. Look, I'm not complaining, you know. I've been- you've been terrific to this point and it would be terribly rude of me to blame you for anything. But I think it's time for me to have a space of my own. A nice little house, not pretentious, but sophisticated with a cozy vibe. A space in which I could read and unwind, far from the turmoil of the deck. Mm. Oddly enough, I see something with an alpine flair. See, even I can be filled with nostalgia sometimes. Again, I won't be pushing on this, but I'd be delighted if you could build it for me. Mm. I bet. Build. What does her lodge want? Oh, I have everything. Okay. Build. Um. Oh, okay. Because I can't build it here. It would have to be... There. Oh. What the heck are you? What? What is that? Greenhouse and bay. The heck was that? Beacon? Huh. Let me, let me adjust how everything is. Uh, edit. So I'm gonna... Swap. Okay, and then from here I can, huh. stick you here, put you there, swap, and then you two go here together. I need to, I need to widen, there's, there's, I'm running out of space. Oh, father dear. Not father, uncle. Uncle dear, what do you have to say? Seems to be quite a few f new faces aboard. I like it, don't get me wrong. I just don't want you to forget about your old uncle at all. You know me. I'm Mr. Personality. I can get along with anyone, any t anywhere, anytime. I just didn't think I'd have to make new friends at my age. You don't have to worry. I'll be alright. Sorry, I even brought it up. I'll just go stand on the edge of the boat and take in the splendor, you know? Hopefully no bugs will fly in my mouth. That's no fun. Kind of funny, considering he's a he's a frog. Oh, are you hungry? Would you like some poached food? Mm. No, sorry, Stella. You know I can't eat fruit for the life of me. I've tried, but I just can't. Okay, fish. Thanks, I love it. Okay. 
I can I can I hug the snake? Can I hug the snake? Oh, I can hug the snake. Oh, I guess sweet. Are you hungry? Oh, you found my weak spot, dear. Can't say no to a dessert. A delightful sugary perfection. Thank you very much. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Uh, kitchen's up here. Cook some carrots. Yeah. Okay, what? I should get some more fish. I should do some more fishing. Wait, I'm here. Hold on. Okay. Uh, what's here? Is oh, there's something here. It's. Wow, this is a toffee. Okay, that did it. Copper. That's... okay. Oh. Hey, I came here to cut down these trees, but I forgot my axe. I'm not gonna start using someone else's axe. That would be strange. Mm. I like the way my axe feels. It's so sturdy and it calms me. Oh, I miss that axe. Mm. I've been passing the time by writing letters and throwing some in the water. I've been writing poetry. It's not very good, but I'm guessing better. Hopefully no one finds my terrible, terrible poetry. <laughs> no promises, bud. <laughs> okay, let's cut you down. Nice. Got the wood. And then we cut this down. Nice. Oh, berries. These look incredible. I was just dreaming about these. Okay, really? That's interesting to know. Oh. <laughs> you want them? Delicious. I had a hankering for these. <laughs> oh, dive. And what do we. Oh. Valuable ring. Where do I sell these? Have I just not unlocked it yet? I'm, I assume so. I've not found this guy's poetry yet. Hmm. Oh well. Back on the boat we go. Hmm. Of course. Oh. <laughs> Wait, I never realized it's a, it's a plastic lemon. Okay. Okay. Off we head. Oh god, my back. Oh. oh. These, they should be done. Nice. Let's plant some more linen, plant a bit of corn. How are you doing? I should water you. Just water you all just in case. Oh. I love it. The cabin is outstanding. It really does wonders to have a place of your own. Doesn't it remind you of my old condo on Waverly? Probably the only place where I could get some peace and quiet. Thank you, old friend. <gasps> Sprout! I took a look at your blueprint station. It's nice, I suppose. But you know what would make it even greater? More plans! Bigger buildings! Better pencils! I'm just saying. I'm sure Albert's an, uh, I'm sure Albert at Albert's shipyard could help you out. So true. Good. 
do some cooking. Uh, cook you. Set sail for Albert Shipyard then. Uh, in we go. You. Uh, ooh. Oh. Why is that? I'm sorry, what? Let's go to this first. Let's go to these crates and then we'll head to the shipyard because it's in like a straightish line. Oh. It's done. Nice. Got some nice cups of coffee. Black coffee to be specific. I'm hmm, okay, so uh, Hot take, I can't have my coffee without some sugar and milk. Okay, I'm one of those people. I've got some thread here. I was going to use it to weave some fabric for you later, but if you want, I can give it to you uh, for you to weave. You want the th thread? There it is. Hey. Sea trash. Quick, jump in the water. There's wreckage. I'm sure you'll find something help some helpful materials in there. Ooh. Sure. Okay, there's nothing there. Over here. Ooh. Nice. Ooh, empty bottle. That'll be good for catching lightning. I was hungry as usual, so I did something about it. I went outside the boat and got some berries, but I went a little overboard. I have too much. Here you go. Have a wonderful day. Oh. Right, so this is what it meant by, oh yeah, uh, they'll gather these materials for you. Let's water you. I need to get these coffee beans. Nice. Coffee. Do I even have anything I can plant here? Yes, I do. Got more coffee. Let's plant you. Uh, anything else here? Anything at all new? Okay. Wait, what's the... Oh! I didn't know that you can... Okay! Hmm. Good to know! I did not know this. Hmm, these might come in handy. Maybe. I thought these were just uh, accessories. Or like, um, not accessories. Um, what's the word? Oh, I forgot the word. But like, it was meant to appear over time. Or rather, it was already there on the ship, and as you upgrade it, then it goes away. Okay, let's set sail for. Albert Shipyard. Okay. I love I I love the, the jumping that I'm pulling off. Okay, let's let's go fish. You do the fish. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I was meant to press X. I, I, I keep getting my buttons confused on this. Hmm. Okay, let's... Oh! <gasps> oh! That's a bottle! Okay, I'll read that after. That's interesting. Okay, let's grab another. What are you gonna be? Come on. Whoa. Come on. 
Okay. Oh, another squid. Two dots to navigate, so we go, bitch. Sleep until the morning. And everyone else go, bitch, too. Nice. Oh, well, I need to water everything. Okay. Uh, ding dong. Water you. Water you. Oh, hi, Arn. Welcome in. Okay, that's all watered. Now we go up and water this. What is this game? Uh, this, the game is called Spirit Spiritfarer. It's, um, it's a resource management game about living, uh, about being in, I guess, the afterlife? Uh, I'm very early in, so I don't know much, but right now what I've been doing is gathering resources to uh, basically help feed the passengers and upgrade the ship. I've been thinking about father recently. When he left with Doug, I didn't feel anything. No sorrow. No hate. No relief. Nothing. It didn't really matter to me, but it mattered to you. You spent three days crying in Amptunia's uh, room. I bought you three sisters and gave you that damn oversized uh, sweater I had knitted a month prior. Mom was appalled, but you felt better. I've long wondered why you were so sad. And the best I could come up with is that you were sad in my stead. Mm. Feeling things I couldn't feel myself. Oh, hi. <laughs> you look so happy! Oh, jump down, look okay. Well, well. Mm. I've got that weird feeling. I'm actually rather hungry. Here you go. That's what I call a perfect blend of coffee. That hits the spot. Mm. Yay! Okay, jump down. Got it. Uh, how do I... How do I? There we go. Hello there, young lady. I guess you must be the new spirit fairer. Happy to make your acquaintance. I'm Francis. You can say I'm sort of one I'm a sort of wandering merchant. See, I'm very fond of things. Objects, curi uh curios, tchotchkes. I just buy everything. Simply put, I don't I will buy anything you don't want anymore. I'm sure you've come across a few valuable treasures already. So tell me, what is it you want to part with? Ooh, do I have a few things for you? Oh, that sells well. Should be. Oh. It's 1k. It's 1k. May I ask, uh, how did you make this cartoon character that looks nice? You mean my, my VTuber model? Uh, I drew it myself. I drew and rigged it myself. Uh, I, I rigged it in a program called Live2D, which is known for um, uh, being able to like animate your drawings. And with that, and the capabilities of the iPhone camera, uh, which is surprisingly really, really good, uh, it basically uses like AR uh, augmented reality face tracking to basically track your face and so it can basically track a bunch of stuff so like my mouth movements my eyes when I blink my brows it's it's really cool it, it really is uh, and yeah that's uh, pretty much the gist of it okay let's, let's sell this so cute, smelly. Okay. Yes, uh, speaking of that, I do have a new one coming out soon-ish. By soon-ish, I mean like maybe two months, uh, once I finish up everything that I need to. <laughs> and by finish, I mean I have only completed about 25% of what I need to get done. <laughs> 
Stella. I've been getting your mail here for the past month. I'm not a post office. So this is called VTroop. Well, uh, I want that too, but I'm awful at designing. Uh, to be fair, uh, there's a pretty much a lot of artists out there who will pretty much be willing to help you with that, myself included. Um, like I've I've helped people basically come up come up with this design from literally zero. Uh, like the most I was given was this is a char an existing anime character that I like, and this is some outfits that I like. What can you do with this? And I I just I I get left to cook, and yeah, that's that's just how it is. <laughs> uh, if you're not good at designing, there's always someone who will be. And I will say, yeah, VTubing is... It's it's fun. <laughs> it, uh, how much would your help cost? Uh, it depends. But uh, for a design uh, from scratch, uh, and especially if it's going to be like a, a VTuber model, I'd say starting price would be about £50. It, de uh, 50 pounds. it depends how much you want basically if you want you can dm me on uh, twitter or discord and we can talk more about it uh, after stream but uh yeah I, I will say though like this stuff does not uh come very cheap <laughs> i will say that you you might uh you you can't do it with like uh you know uh pocket change essentially is the best way i can say it yeah, I'd be, I'd be happy to help. You need to add a mailbox to your boat. If you get one more letter filled with glitter, I'll lose it. It's an investment, basically? Yes, 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 yes. Uh, my initial VTuber model, I did not rig it, but I did draw it. Because I, I swore getting it, uh, paying uh, one of my friends to rig it. That, that was basically an, uh, an investment, and I did make that money back in the end. <laughs> I am warning you, you might be a customer, but I reserve the right to yell at you. Get it done. Okay. Uh, ooh, I can get this. I need linen thread. Okay. Uh, ooh. I see. Oh, okay. Oh, I need linen thread and maple plank. Uh, Alright, thank you. I'll DM you after stream. Okay, thank you, thank you. Uh, the intrepid otter is a meat. Hmm. Okay. What time are we on? Mm, okay. Let's, yeah. Okay, the time, it might be, it might be. <laughs> it might actually be time to end stream. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna find a song to raid. It is unfortunately almost dinner time. So I must, I must go consume the foods, you know? Right, who to raid? Who to raid? Uh, let's see. Okay, sure. <sighs> okay. Ooh, I am my my bones feel uh crunchy right now. <laughs> I, I I don't know why I've been feeling like super super sleepy today. I I don't I don't know why, but eh. but I have found us someone to raid, someone who I don't know either. So this will this will be a new person for us all. Oh, thank you for the hydrate. <laughs> oh, I needed that. <laughs> And thank you, everyone who came by for today's stream. Uh, I appreciate it, as always. If you don't know me, I stream every day except Tuesdays and Fridays, so drop a follow if you don't want to miss that. I'll be back tomorrow for... Uh, maybe 
maybe I'll play, finally play some Day of the Diver, because <laughs> I keep forgetting to do that. I'll play some Day of the Promise. Promise. <laughs> Please stick around for the raid, show them some love in chat, maybe drop a follow, all that good stuff. There is the raid message, so please throw that in their chat. Uh, there's one for the subs and the non-subs. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, in enjoy. Uh, thank you, thank you, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye-bye!